People, it's time to go grocery shopping. <laughs> grocery shopping. In today's episode, how do you do in Welcome. So the weather outside is fantastic. It's a little windy and it's a little cloudy, but I have to go out on a bike ride. And for the first time this year, <laughs> I'm wearing shorts. I will bring some sort of, I will be bringing these pants with me if it's too cold, because in these corona times, you really don't want to get a cold, right? You want to be as hardy as you can if you get infected so um <laughs> as to getting some sun oh by the way the plans are going on a bike ride sort of just driving around doing nothing just sort of i i, I want to try to find an app that can sort of follow me so i can see later on on a map where i've been do you have any suggestions about that? Something that tracks me and sort of shows me you've been here and then you were here and then you were here. And what else? After that, I am going to get home, going to get dressed in long pants like a big boy. And then I'm going to go grocery shopping because I need to buy groceries for next week's vegan cooking. And after that, who knows? I might even... What? clean the apartment. So people, my house is somewhere over there and just on the other side of the tracks of this big road that passes my house going south there is this big 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 area of warehouses and it's like I don't know can you see it's really fascinating and being Sunday there's no one here so uh, Feels like sort of zombie town. Okay, people, these houses, I think, because there are people living in them. I think they're built from dumpsters or some sort that just assembled that way. I'm going to try to show you a little bit better. So, this is kind of interesting, isn't it? It's really interesting. It doesn't it doesn't look like dumpsters, right?
never knew this sort of area existed. So people now I'm about to go under that big road. So this is a aqueduct? No, sub I don't know the word for tunnel. Yes, it's a tunnel. So now I'm on the right track, side of the tracks. back home and have lunch. Lunch needs to be had. People, it's time to go grocery shopping. <gasps> grocery shopping! So I will be cooking from this magazine. It's the latest e issue of Vigo magazine and I put the paper clip there. So I know that I will be buying ingredients for this uh, sort of tomato soup with garlic crouton and this green bean with gremolata and also Korean, Korea, Korean tofu with coriander. You know, it's only half past two in the afternoon and I feel, I got the feeling, maybe because I took that long bike ride before, that's, it's almost like it's evening to me, like seven o'clock or something. That's what my internal clock says. And quite cold and looks like it might rain. I bought all the Greek groceries, but I think it's time for some ice cream. Some vegan lovely ice cream. People, there, there's also going to be some baking. Some baking with cornflakes. And I think the rain is going to pass. The sun is going to stay. People, I was planning on having a sort of easy evening all by myself, watching YouTube videos and whatnot, reading books. Then I got a text from Martin wondering if I want to come over to his place and watch a bootleg video of some Broadway show. And I said, of course, yes, because, I mean... You can always stay at home, but when you're asked, you go, go. So I thought, what are we going to do? And then I remember, oh, wait, I was going to cook. I was going to bake with those cornflakes. So this is what I did. Mm -hmm. 